As you can see from right here to all the way to right here are all the figures that we're gonna be unboxing today. And I actually have a couple more things and some other videos that I'm gonna show y'all, like including this, which is my 1954 uh, Godzilla shirt. And I have a Godzilla phone case, which is really cool. The Godzilla snapback. I have some posters that I'm gonna show y'all. And um, I wanted to talk about a little uh, thing real quick. Um, if y'all have ever heard of Loot Crate, um, Loot Crate Exclusive, I think they're called. And um, basically they, I think made another website. I don't really know who did it, but um, it's called Loot Launcher. And basically it relaunches old loot crates that were going on. And right now there's a couple that are Godzilla. Um, and yeah, so go check that out if you want that. Um, I don't know. I'm, so, yeah, that's all about that. So, depending on which figure you want to see, it's going to be the video that you click on. Um, depending on what video you're watching, the figure will be in the description, the video. Um, but, yeah, let's get into these figures guys we have the 68 Godzilla and we have King Caesar I don't know if it's Final Wars version or Showa version so anyways uh, let's get into this so they're all Bandai same size type figures and The last one on the show came last is the one I was waiting on. Otherwise, I would have done it on my birthday. Y'all know this. This is the third figure that I'm showing, and if you're watching them in order, it has gone King Caesar, 1968, Godzilla, and now Mecha King Ghidorah. Now, his wings aren't too flexible. You're not supposed to do this with them, and I'm just gonna put them back like that. And yeah, he's just. He's a really awesome figure. I have always loved Mecha King Adora. He's just, I don't know. He's kind of like Mecha Godzilla, I guess you could say. He's, I don't know, he's just cooler. Um, and obviously this is the Heisei Ghidorah, which is the 80s, late 80s and 90s, maybe even early 80s. Yeah, early 80s too, because the 1984 is uh, Heisei Godzilla 2, or actually, uh, to me, it's Heisei Godzilla 1, and then there's Heisei Godzilla 2, but anyways, we're not going to get into that. Um, he has the horns, obviously, and yeah, that just kind of wraps up Mega King Adora, guys. Um, is what you would want in a King Adora figure. 
Um, like I said, I'm gonna be getting more in the future, and one of them might might be King Adora, so stay tuned for that. So yeah, that's my Mega King Adora. Uh, I hope you enjoy. Peace out.